Ecclesiastes 3 says, To everything there is a season, a time to every purpose under the heavens. You see, the purpose of life is a life of purpose. And so when we celebrate the birthday, we don't just celebrate life, we celebrate purpose. Because it's not necessarily how long we live, but how well we live. Jesus lived basically about 33 years, and over 2,000 years after we still feel his impact. You see, our lives are like butterflies, and without three paired legs, two paired wings, paired and decorated eyes, a metamorphosis into greatness and purpose. It's no instant noodle. It's not indoor. It's more like Pauneniam and Afam. There's a process to it. So coming out of the shadows of shell with flying colors, dancing like a ballerina or a flag in the air, doesn't happen overnight. It happens overnight, over over days of our blood, sweat, and tears. Moments when your spirit had to force your body to move. Even when your soul didn't feel like moving on. Clips when your courage was clipped. Your vision eclipsed by darkness. Your hope and the sight. You can't even remember the color of light at the end of the tunnel. But the brightness of success is far-fetched. And giving up seems to be the only oasis. This metamorphosis proceeds. On those days when you stare at your account balance and you stare at you like, I still believe in you. <laughs> I haven't given up on you. On those days when we hold firmly to our vision. You see, growth is not, is not that technical junction to our tomorrow. Ask me why. Ask me why. Because we can't bypass the stage and think that will be at home. And just in case you like to pass through people's verandas, just know that there is no shortcuts to growth. There's no problem. But there could be VIOs. <laughs> there will be DOPTs. <laughs> the there could be bombs on the road. There could be potholes. But to get to purpose, we have to hold firm, determine, stay focused, and remember there's always a place called there. Thank you.